on the smell of lemon shampoo. I make you feel good without feeling used and we have an unspoken agreement that I am yours. Her eyes are everything I'm not but her laugh is everything I am and you tell me you really care about this one. I smile and I believe you. You cheat on her. Girl number one, you claim you're tired. I tell you it's okay, we all get tired. Not tired like bed sheets, tired like too many red lights. Tired like not enough days off. Tired like the sun in September hanging low in the sky. I tell you to take some time to think. We watch movies in my living room with the lights off, you leave her. You cheat on girl number two, you say you don't know how it happened. I tell you it's okay, we all make mistakes. You say you're tired of making the wrong ones. You're three numbers short of a winning raffle ticket every time. You don't answer her phone calls. You leave her and I begin to fill up your photo album. You cheat on girl number three, you tell me you can't see straight. I tell you it's okay, sometimes the windows get foggy. You don't know how things got so fucked up, and I don't tell you that I'm not the only one of us with daddy issues. You surprise me with a smile, and it's like watching a falling star. You tell me about the future as you leave her. You cheat on girl number four, you say it's all you know how to do. I tell you it's okay, it's not your fault, that's what you were taught. You hold an unregistered plane ticket in your hand and set her like a broken record you're tired of pretending to know the lyrics to. I laugh at your liquid courage, you kiss my forehead, you leave her. You cheat on girl five, six, seven, brown hair and plain eyes and they're all starting to look the same. You say you're worried about your mom because we both know she's the only woman you've ever loved. I tell you it's okay, you have time on your side. And your smile cracks and I think about the first time you said my name. You leave her. You hold my bleeding hands and you leave her. And you leave her and all you ever seem to do is leave, like the blow-up mattress you put in your living room that takes up too much space. And the next morning you deflate it and put it in your basement without wondering where all the air ended up. You leave her while I sit on the back porch of your mind, etching our agreement into my skin. Sometimes I wonder if you think about our agreement becoming a promise, a lifestyle. And girl number I've lost count comes into the picture and you cheat on her. I tell you it's okay, I will sit next to you on the playground like first grade because each time you skin your knee it hurts the same. You tell me you're trying to love yourself first but I love you for the both of us, you leave her and your fingertips touch mine. You cheat on me. I tell you it's okay. And you stay. All right, this next poem is about two things I'm very passionate about, which are feminism and our generation taking over. I'm just past the room of pedophilia, but not old enough to fuck. Seventeen, you can't buy me a drink, but you can write me off. And you think if you squint your eyes just right, I might look twenty-three. I am your worst nightmare wrapped in red seductive paper, and you can't wait to rip off the tape. Seventeen, running past a bar to my truck, hearing whistles from middle-aged mouths. Your ex-wives don't call you until it's after 10 p.m. Until then, you've got a kamikaze in my legs. But your hands will only grip one of those two tonight. Seventeen, the concept of half-molded clay. Like I don't have ideas. Like I can't challenge your body with my mind. I can smoke weed in the morning and discuss Aristotle at noon. You've mistaken me for a Taylor Swift song. I'm 21 pilots, Metallica, shaking in black boots, 17, and a 10-hour school day never looked this good without makeup. I am a quivering GPA lipstick to the college board. They analyze its pretty pink color with a kiss. I'll know I'll be accepted. 17, I'm wearing two short dresses your masculinity can't handle because you're used to Generation X. Slicked back hair too greasy for my pale skin, and the stench of your cologne only makes me feel smaller. 17, don't squeeze me too tight. I'm not a goal you can make with your body. You only seem to see my body. I am more than a body. I am 17 and I only ask to be 17. Don't make me sex up too fast. The world is not ready for all the intelligence I cannot give because it is trapped somewhere in your bald fist, clenched tight, upright, and screaming for you to stop calling me a bitch for saying no. I didn't tell you my name for a reason. You don't deserve that much, 17. So I'll pretend I'm eight again and I remind you of your daughter and me in a bra is a faraway dream. I won't look behind me as you follow me home, 17 more steps until I meet the main road. 17 more seconds of your eyes on my waist. 17 times before you ask me if I'm really asking for it. 17 tears falling on my lips and I'm trying not to crack. 17 days until I turn 18 and never look back. Yeah. 